During our visit to, uh, to Morocco, we had a discussion with the British ambassador uh, on the telephone, a very unsatisfactory one, uh, in my view, because the British ambassador, again, like on so many other occasions, has tried to indicate that we cannot recognize Western Sahara because somehow it will impinge or affect our relationship with our own overseas territories and particularly with the Falkland Islands. And yet when I pressed the British ambassador to explain why and how uh, this could be the case, uh, no satisfactory response uh, was forthcoming. So I would like to seek clarification from the minister on this point. Is it the fact that we cannot recognize Western Sahara as being Moroccan because there is some legal or constitutional technical difficulty uh, that may affect our relationship with our overseas territories. I can't quite see that as France also, uh, who is in the process of recognizing this issue, also has overseas territories. I would be very grateful if the minister could explain uh, that point to me uh, when he is speaking. We need to recognize Western Sahara, as Israel and America has done, uh, and or at the very least to follow Spain, the former colonial power, Germany and France, in recognizing that the autonomy proposals are the only way forward.